so freaking good right now. That's not a good thing. First of all, I love this mask. My face feels so dry, so <laughs> let me wipe it because you are supposed to use this on clean, dry skin, but I always put chapstick on because I can't do dry lips. I don't like doing dry anything, but I certainly can't stand dry lips. Need to hydrate my face. I've been enjoying this Nurturium Hyaluronic Acid Essence 2% because it is loose and hydrating. So you've got serum where it will be a little bit thicker. This one is almost the consistency of a water, you feel what I'm saying? And I love that because what I've been doing is using the both of them. So I do this one first whenever I use it, and then I do the serum afterward, which is right here, and this was sent to me. This is the Naturium Quadruple Hyaluronic Acid 5%. It is the winter months, honey. So if you were one of those people who was always trying to dehydrate your face. I'm too oily, I'm too shiny. I wanna feel dry and matte. If you are living in an area where the weather has cooled down, honey, it is time to reverse all of that. Reverse, it's time, okay? It is the time now. Speaking for myself, my skin has been a lot drier. The skin on my body, my chest has been flaring up with eczema, my neck has been dry, and my face has been dry too. I'll do my skincare and you know when I go out I like to have that do to my face because then I know that my skin is hydrated and then it just feels comfortable. Pharmacy, wake up, honey, eye cream. Honey, even yesterday I was like why, do I, why does my face look dry? It felt fine but it just looked, it looked dull and I was like oh no. So the skincare that you were using in the summertime, it's time to make some changes to that. And these two products are good. I'm sure you can do one or the other. You don't have to have the two. I have the two, that's why I use the two, you feel me? But definitely having a hyaluronic acid will be beneficial to get these eye bookers out. And you just wanna make sure that you're doing a more hydrating routine. Even this, even this Fenty SPF moisturizer, I don't feel is dewy enough for me. It's not. This is what I had on yesterday and I felt like, I want, my moist, I want my SPF moisturizer to give me a dewy finish. I had to stop for a second because I need to think about this. This is an SPF moisturizer combined. What I could do is put on a hydrating moisturizer and then an SPF on top. For instance, you know I still love the Shiseido Clear Stick one because it's so easy and it does leave a subtle satin finish. It's not completely dewy like, like a, ooh, let me think. There's an Aturium one that literally is a dewy SPF. It's great. There is a super group one that looks like a stick and it literally leaves a shine on the face that's in my studio it's not here so this one is good and i'm thinking to myself literally i could see myself putting on the tatcha indigo overnight repair cream literally in the daytime i don't care it's about what the product will do for my skin and then putting on my spf on top of that so you can finagle stuff like if you're feeling really dry in the morning or the daytime take your night cream if you feel comfortable doing that if you feel like it'll give you a good result try it out if you hate it wash it off and change your products you feel me but if you want a little more hydration you have to change what you're using it is the winter time it's a must so now i'm standing here like which one should i do because this one didn't really do me like i need to i look i always got the weather as well today's gonna be 75 that's not that's not warm enough for my skin why do i look like this is good for my skin for the summertime because i don't be too dewy you feel me but look here i'm putting it on now but you'll see what i mean i'm gonna braid my hair and you'll see that the shine will subside where i actually like for it to stay i just feel like it just it shows me that my skin is hydrated. I, I look at how my skin looks 
after I've done my skincare and even hours into the skincare being on my face, once it's absorbed, did the dew subside? Well, that means that my skin just sucked everything up. And for me to feel more comfortable, I need more. That's what I'm trying to say, basically. So you'll know after an hour or so of doing your skincare, if you still feel like you're, if you still, if you still look dewy and that's what you want, because again, it's about how you want your skin to look and feel, then you've done the right steps. If you look and feel dry or dehydrated, then and you want to look dewy, you feel me? Because again, it's about how you want to look and feel, then you know you need to make some changes. So it's really about how your skin looks and feels after you've done your routine, then you want to make some changes depending on what's going on. Is that clear? I don't know. Mm. Love this thing, honey. Three minutes a day. I did it twice because I was still lotioning. So I did the ready and the blue, anti-aging and anti-acne. Why not? It is working really well. I really enjoy it. And it's easy. I don't feel any burning, tingling, and it just works. I'm gonna cornrow my hair. I haven't done that in a very long time. Let me let me let me correct that. I haven't done small cornrows in a very long time. I normally will just do two to go underneath my braids, whereas now I wanna do one, two, three, four, five, six. I want them tighter. I wanna protect my hair better. And I wanna keep them in for maybe two weeks just to give my hair a break and keep it in some wigs. Cause mainly I want the break. I'm tired of washing my hair so much. I'm just sick of it. <laughs> I just want to break basically. Here's a lot shorter. Oh my gosh. When I wash it now, I can tell, even just washing it, touching it, I can tell my hair is so much shorter. <laughs> this, you might look at it as damage. She didn't, my, the hairstylist did not call it damage. She said my hair was fine. I mean, this is freshly, fresh new growth, whereas this is the parts where I had the keratin treatment. It's all going to grow out, whatever. Whatever, wherever, you feel me? I already use a leave-in conditioner in the, I already use a leave-in conditioner in the shower. I just like putting a little bit extra moisture. This is the Pattern Beauty Hair Milk. And I made sure not to do my nails because I knew I'm gonna do these braids. And I just want freedom when I'm doing these braids. I don't wanna be having to tussle through nails. Now, I normally go this way to braid but I've been enjoying just doing it like this, which is so strange to me. That's not even how I learned how to braid, you feel me? But I've just been enjoying doing it like that. Isn't that so odd? That is so wild to me. I never even knew that this was a possibility until I would see people doing it and I'd be like, excuse me, what is she doing? Now granted, this is not very tight. This is not tight at all. If I were doing it how I had my hands the other way, these braids would be a lot tighter. But it's, it's whatever, I just need my hair down. I don't need this to feel like I've gone to a Ghanaian auntie to braid my hair and now I can't even move my head to the side because the braids are so tight. That's not what I'm trying to have. And I like to braid my hair while it's wet because it moves better. It does what I need easier. I don't blow dry it first, absolutely not. So yeah, even this bottom part right here, I'm making it loose. I don't need this to be wicked tight and perfect, like come on. And even toward the end, I'm gonna just do the twirl because we're gonna be connecting, connecting, connecting. This is, the braids do not, do not need to go down to the ends of my hair, no way. So we already had dinner, now it's time to get undressed for bed. I know I spent a lot of time in my bathroom. I enjoy being in here. I mean, growing up, I never had a bathroom like this. So this is such a happy place for me. It's comfortable, it's beautiful. I just finished eating. I had bacon wrapped shrimp and some veggies for dinner. And actually, when I think about it, that's the only, oh, I had some wings earlier. It was left over from Hooters, honey. That, that wasn't real food. I mean, a few wings and that was it, you feel me? So it's time to take this off. I hate getting undressed. We talked about that a little bit ago. Hold on, that TV is loud. The annoying thing about these pajamas, like I told you, is that they feel wrinkly. So this is, I did not steam this one. I just, my my uh, my areola incisions are still extremely itchy. Okay, so I will be going like this sometimes because it's just, oh, I don't wanna rip them off, yo. I'm telling you, healing is going well. It's just, the itching is still there sometimes. God help me, Lord, deliver me. Deliver me, Ankasa. Okay.
So I need to fold this. I <laughs> wish I didn't have to because I did my face late today. <laughs> it was what, four o'clock when I did my face? Who am I? You know what? Okay, fine. I was about to say, I didn't just take this whole freaking wig off, but hey, let's just keep it on for a little bit longer. Hello, we're chatting here. <sighs> let's talk. I, you know, I find myself go, go, going a lot. I don't always process what I'm learning, thinking, feeling. I do that once a week in therapy. But I recognize that it would still be helpful and edifying to have these discussions together. So I have to always remind myself of that. What is that? Is that lash glue? I cannot. What? Guan, please let me know. Oh, I already flossed while I was in the bathroom. I keep floss picks all over, so I can floss whenever I see fit because I can't stand. I can't stand food in my teeth. And my teeth still look great from that time that I whitened was that two weeks ago i don't even know when but i have been i've been on a journey in a lot of areas a lot of areas one of which is being in control of my reaction to a lot of things and people you feel me there's so much strength in knowing that i can say something knowing that i can do something knowing that i can meet you where you are whoever that person is, and then being like, you know what, I'm just not going to. It's okay if I don't have the last laugh or the last comment. Or, you know what's so painful? <laughs> is being okay with the narrative being... I thought that was a hair. I thought that was a hair that was bothering me. Being okay with the narrative being, in my opinion, in my perspective, incorrect. There's nuance in how something how something happened and how we both experienced it because our experiences i'm talking about any kind of relationship any the experience can be different you feel me but i've found comfort i have found peace it's not comfortable but i have found peace in our experiences being different and in some cases, my perspective not being heard. So let's say you have a phone out with somebody and they, you think, you don't have evidence, or maybe you don't have evidence, are running with a narrative that in your experience or in your perspective is not true. <laughs> I've just found peace in being like, and that's okay. Like what? You feel me? I mean, it just is what it is. And that has taken a lot of growth because who doesn't want to be like, no, that's actually not how it happened. You feel me? But this is all dust flying around. I also don't like being told that what I feel is incorrect. So I've had to sit with the, the flip side of that, which is, okay, well, if I don't want to be told that what I experienced is incorrect, then how can I tell you that, no, what you're saying is actually wrong? And now, granted, we know one plus one equals two, right? I'm talking about that. But when it comes to, I feel like this, I feel like that, well, that is how you feel. You feel what I'm saying? And one thing that I, one thing that I hate, I will always hate, is being told that how I feel is wrong or how I feel is inaccurate. It's a feeling, so you cannot, and I will not, let me wait about to be sitting back on. <laughs> you cannot, and I will not allow anyone to diminish how I feel because it makes you uncomfortable. Now, here's the thing. You can diminish my feelings. And I can tell you that I don't give a damn. You feel me? So that's just where I am. I am almost 40 years old. And I don't have time to be dismissed. I don't have time for my feelings not to matter. And this is for anybody. I mean, anybody. I don't know what I'm my mom. She's just, a, you know, bless her heart. I love her. She really prioritizes us having a relationship. And I've even thought to myself, like, dang, how's that going to be for me? Because that, that's got to be hard for her. But her priority is us having a relationship more than it is her being right. So I remember one time, we would, we would have a little bit of a disagreement. Not often, right? And one time she, she, she said to me, she was like, yeah, whenever you're upset or whatever you are, I just ignore it. And I'm like, what? <laughs> Excuse me? She's like, yeah, I just ignore you. I'm like, 
oh okay she's like yeah because you know i rather have a relationship with you than to argue with you so i just ignore you and i'm like huh okay that's one way to look at it and i processed that and i thought how strong of her because you have some parents who would run you over with a tractor trailer for you to be forced to accept and understand their their point of view you feel me so that really just blessed my heart i was like man that is actually nice of her because i don't stay upset long and especially with her you know she doesn't my mom is really great honestly we don't we don't be having many problems we have had problems but they don't be often you feel me i'm just grateful for where i am right now when it comes to self-control because that is so important do i get triggered absolutely it is a daily walk i tell you it is a daily walk but i'm i'm so grateful to be in more be in more control be more in control excuse me to be more in control of myself that's important yo that's important because going on the days where you made me even make it makes any sense let's take that out of our our vocabulary you made me no you didn't because of this i feel okay it's not you made me because of this i feel now it can feel like oh you made me do that it can feel like that you feel me but we really need to be accountable at our big age to say i felt like this or when you did this i felt like that and that's why x y and z it doesn't justify it but it, certainly, it explains why we've come to this juncture you feel me let's brush our teeth oh you know me one thing i'm gonna do is brush my teeth let's break my tongue the whole nine yards we do this all the time but it's important i didn't learn all these things when i was younger i mean who's teaching the girls these things i think it's important for us to talk about not everyone is i already had this talk with you let's not beat a dead horse for that sake i'm fine with accountability but i'm not a person who is motivated by that so what i mean is i don't like people being on me I don't like people being on my case. That's not gonna motivate me in the least. In fact, it's gonna piss me off. This is the Marcella, Marcella, Mar what? Marcella, this is not Marcella, Marcella, what? I just combined Marcella, Margella, and Mar Marcella. Garnet, here, I'm so sick. It's too many words, it's too late. So yeah, I'm not the kind of person that likes that. I actually get irritated by that. You are not gonna find me getting a personal trainer because I don't want you talking to me when I'm working out because I'm freaking tired. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> and I don't do group classes because if I want to take a pause and you want to tell us to keep on going, I'm not going to be, I'm going to be pissed off. I need to move at my own speed. Just end of story, right? For better or worse, that's just how it is for me. I'm getting better about taking better care of my lashes because yo, the ripping off thing really isn't good. So what I'm saying is that keeping, keeping, keeping promises to myself have become more important because I have to be a woman of my word. That's important to me. That's not just a man's thing. Be a man of your word. I need to be a woman of my word and to myself. For many of us, it's so easy to keep our word to someone else. If you say you're gonna do something for somebody, you don't want them to be disappointed in you. You don't want them to look at you crazy, so you're gonna do it. But if it has something to do with you, if you said you're going to wake up at certain so-and-so time in the morning, if you said that you're going to work out, if you said you were going to read a chapter of your book each day and you wake up later, you just don't get to it. You just feel like, oh, it's okay. It's not a big deal. I'll just do it another time. And then another time he comes another time and another time and another time. And I can't stand that. If it's not already obvious, I'm, usually, I'm, I'm more of a serious person. I'm playful, but I'm serious too. I'm... I'm I'm just a very let's get it done person. This is the Desi Perkins cleanser. What? So skin soul balm melting. What? Skin soul balm makeup melting cleansing balm. I enjoy this. This is really good. I'm a very serious person. I just need to get things done. I like to play around. You see that, right? But like, what are we doing? I'm very much the what are we doing? Okay, so what now what? That's me, right? So um, with that said, I've just become more... I'm, I'm operating in, in more of the, if I say I'm going to do it, I need to freaking do it. That's how I began doing keto years ago. That's how I started my business. That's how I've done a lot of things. That's how I've accomplished a lot of things. If I said I'm going to do it, let's freaking do it. Cut the excuses. Just shut up. Because for me, when I would, when I would complain about my weight and how I didn't feel comfortable, I didn't feel happy, all of this... It came to a point where I just needed to shut the hell up. Just shut up and do what I see I'm going to do. So with this said, what I'm saying is I made some promises to myself the other day. I'm always writing things down. I'm always making my to-do list and things. 
And getting up at four in the morning or just getting up early is important to me because I like to start my day when it's dark outside. I like to get a head start on the day. It gives me more hours because in the evening, I want to go to bed. I don't like staying up late. I might get blindsided and freaking <laughs> distracted on TikTok or whatever it is, but do I enjoy being up late? Absolutely not. So when it comes to doing stuff for myself, it's important that I keep, keep my word to myself, right? I'm not just here trying to keep my word to other people. What about me? This is the Youth to the People Kale Green Spinach Vitamins Face Wash. So it's important for me to keep my word to myself because if not, who am I? You feel me? So I've been doing a better job. Oh my God, wait, this thing tastes like salt. Hold on. <laughs> this is the Deuterium Hyaluronic Acid Essence. I'm going to do this before my prescription acne treatment it has tretinoin in it, clindamycin, and niacinamide. I'm going to go on top of the eyes because why not add hydration and also underneath. And so here it is. This is apostrophe one pump. This will help keep my face from breaking out, girl. It's been a while since I broke out, but there was a time where I was breaking out a lot and I don't know what it was <laughs> except I wasn't consistent with this. You feel me? Cause I don't yet know, and I've had I've had rosacea since before I came to Houston, and I've been in Houston for 13 years, so I've had rosacea for 15 years, and I don't I can't pinpoint any triggers. It just be happening. You feel me? It just it just happens. As I was saying, very important for me to keep my promises to myself, and when it comes to waking up early, working out, I've been working on being more serious about that. I'm not saying that every day. I'm up at four o'clock. That's not realistic in the least. But for the nights where I say to myself, tomorrow's a 4 a.m. day, I'm doing it. I'm doing it whether I feel like it or not. You feel me? Or if I say tomorrow is a workout day, if it's one o'clock and I've yet to work out, I'm freaking gonna work out. And I do not like working out late. <laughs> I need to do the stuff that I that takes more energy from me early. Cause that's when I have the energy usually. Even when I'm sleepy, that's when I feel like doing it more is what I'm saying. This is the Naturium Quadruple Hyaluronic Acid Serum, five and five, I'm say five and a half, five percent. That's when I have more of the energy to do it. So what I'm trying to say is this, if I'm tired in the morning and at night, I'm better off doing whatever it is in the morning versus at night. Do you see what I'm saying? So if it's gonna be a workout, if it's gonna be even filming, it needs to be in the morning. It's better for me. I'm just more, I'm more into it. This is the Tatcha Indigo Overnight Repair Cream. So rich. Ooh, so luxurious. It even looks, it looks like glass. It just even looks good, but it feels good. When I wake up, this is still on my face. Especially the size of my face, where I, the side of my face that I haven't laid on. I do lay on one side of my face. I really shouldn't do that. Wrinkles, hello. I really should be sleeping on my back, but that's not always comfortable and it reminds me of when I was recovering from the surgery and I had no choice but to sleep on my back for how long how long was it was it three months yo three months sleeping on your back is crazy this I do wake up with still on my face and if you oh let me put something I can just what's very important I feel deserves my full attention and these things are very important to me for character development for physical development, working out and eating better and that kind of thing. Very important too. So it's just important. Girl, we are not getting any younger. You feel me? And I have a child who is watching me. He's seeing me work hard, work out. One day I worked out at night and he knows I don't do night workout. And he was like, mommy, what are you doing? And I was like, well, it's important that we keep our promises to ourselves. And I said that I was going to work out earlier and I never got around to it. So that means I have to work out now at night. And I don't like working out at night, but it's important that we keep our word, right? And he said, yeah. And I said, so I'm going to do workout right now. Even if it's 30 minutes, I'm going to work out. And I actually did 45, 50 minutes that day. And he looked like, his face looked like he was so proud of me. And I will never forget that. The kids are always watching and listening. So I'm not doing this just for myself. I'm setting the example for my child, which makes me so happy. I encourage you. Yo, how about, okay, I need to do makeup to film content. I'm about to do that now. I feel 
sleepy, but this is one of those days where it doesn't matter how I feel. I have to push through because I have things to do. If there's a lack of energy, that is precisely why. And how about my face has already lightened up from the summertime. My skin is not as dark on my face as it was this summer, especially around the eyes, and that's normal. I still, however, like to match to my neck and chest. You see a difference to my, my chest and my face. It's me coming down with a soft throat. And it's all, oh, this wig smells good. Yo, when you spray your fragrance, if you ever get it on your hair, <laughs> the hair be smelling good, yo. But then again, the next time you put that wig on, if you don't want to smell like that, then that's not going to be a good thing. Granted, I do have hair fragrance that I use, but this wig ended up getting sprayed on because I was spraying the back of my neck, on the side of my neck, I mean, and I noticed that it wasn't getting onto my skin. Well, it was getting on my hair. <laughs> so my hair has a bunch of fragrance on the, on the sides. I like the scent though, so I'm not upset. I really enjoy the scent. It's a... Valentino scent. Okay, let's give this hair a brush. This hair needs to be washed. It's been, I mean, I've been wearing this forever, just putting it on and I haven't washed it. It's not, it's not weighed down by product. I just, especially since it has that fragrance on it, I now feel like it needs to be washed because come on, you know, but it, it's still fluffy. It doesn't feel wet and greasy. That's, that's for sure. Cause I do take off my wigs at night. If I kept this on 24 seven, oh yeah. So yeah, it already, it just has this natural bump in the front, which I love. And if you saw my other video, you saw me cutting this. Ah, it was so fun. This came in the mail from YSL. I did not even know there was a new fragrance. So let's smell it together. You know, I love to do these videos separately, but let's bring it here to YouTube as well. This is the Libre Absolute Platine, Platine, Jesus. Pl Listen, I don't know anything about this. I didn't, I, I have no idea what this is. And it comes with a card on the inside. I saw that earlier. Okay, hold on, let's take it out. We know that the component is so large. Let me not even break off my nails. What? Hold on. This looks like 1.7. I look at this silver on the inside. Obviously the liquid is not silver. That's just the packaging. However, now this is annoying because how you wanna know how much you have left over? That's actually not a good thing. This is clearly full. But you can't, you can't even tell when it's done. Mm, that's not a good thing. What? Okay, well, beautiful component as always. Let me get a paper towel. Okay, let's spray this. Nice sprayer. Huh, it's fresh. Maybe Violet has the YSL DNA. Huh. Hmm, as it's drying down, I like this a lot. <laughs> I know that I said it a lot, but it's true. I like this. Ooh, as it's drying down, this is lovely. Let's look up these notes. Interesting. You know, I don't use Siri often. She'd be on a lot of breaks. Hey Siri, show me, what? Show me YSL, see this is where the accent ain't gonna work. Show me YSL Libre Absolute Platine. Watch her come and show me Platine. Okay. I can, oh! Found this on the web. She showed it to me. Show me YSL, show me YSL Libre Absolute Platinum. Check it out. Platinum? You doing too much. She actually got it correct. Ooh, not my French accent being great or whatever. Okay, so it's a, hi. It's a floral fragrance with lavender, orange blossom, and musk accord. This is the highest intensity. So toilette is lower. Eau de parfum, eau de parfum intense, le parfum. And then there's l'absolu platine. So this is the strongest intensity according to the YSLbeautyUS.com YSL website. Interesting, so this should last longer. It's definitely grown and sexy. I don't see this for a young lady. I don't, unless she's a sophisticated young lady. She wants to be represented, come across as a sophisticated woman, then I can see this for a young woman. I wouldn't call this edgy at all, you know, it's not. I wouldn't even call this fall. I would call this all year round. I like it, I'm gonna wear it today. Hmm, put it on my, let's put it on my neck. Not on the hair, on the neck. <laughs> On the sides, I get dry on the front, so I'm just putting it on my sides. But if you get dry in general, just skip the neck, okay? I'm gonna go right here in between the breast and right here so that while I'm doing my makeup, I can get whiffs of it. And let's see how I feel about it. Hmm. Put this right here too. The, the bottle is just so sexy. Far, far away now Got all of the time you need Yeah, you got the space ground What do you call loyalty? You ain't gotta stay down Caught yourself a voice 
avoiding me Oh, I guess you're so proud Young, you a hoe, eh? my respect, yo Young, you a hoe, eh? my respect I'm finna be checked on Never, ever slept on Young, you a hoe, eh? my respect You're a shapeshifter Who walk good from me I know your pantry's probably just like how mine was. Girl, it's just, we just got stuff up in there, okay? Ain't no rhyme or reason. It was just, just too much. But now it looks so much better. I'll show you later. I'm so excited about it. Yo, so I need to clean these. These Amazon, oh, they're wicked dirty. Excuse me? Gross. And then the top be all gunky looking because of my lashes. I'm annoyed. I wonder why I couldn't see well in these. I'm waiting on door. DoorDash because I'm taking lunch to Denise school. I still do the weekly lunches and uh, I need to order this sooner, but I hate my food cold and I hate his food cold. I hate anyone's food cold. So I try to time it with my order, but then I find myself delayed because the person is not here yet. Anyway, I have on this dress from Amazon. It is very see-through. I was trying to explain that earlier, but I had the phone, I had the camera on S and Q, which is slow mode. I don't know what the Q means. I don't know. This thing is extremely see-through. I have on black shorts beneath it. I mean, it's a very thin material. Ain't no lining, ain't no nothing. I don't know why Amazon does this, but here we are. And then, you know, my same old, same old wig, you feel me? I need to clean these sunglasses. And after that, Infinity has been such a huge help. Listen, it help is important, okay? We're going to go and get some bins and things to organize the pantry. It's been a long time coming. I... I have way too much on my mind to do that I just cannot even think about organizing that pantry, but thank God it's about to get done. So we're going to tackle that today. And then we're supposed to go to dinner tonight. I'm saying it's supposed to because we are going to go. I want to go. But the way I am, yo, if something is real late, by that time when it gets there, I don't even have the energy to go anymore. I say yes now, but later on today, I'm not going to want to go. So anyway, we're supposed to go. We'll see. I have a headache. I, I had a migraine early this morning. And I took a lot of Tylenol to get it away. I mean, I took two Tylenols twice. That's how bad the migraine was. And I still feel it slightly right here. It's not intense. Nowhere near what it was when I woke up. But it's it's, it's still light. I don't know where it came from. Too much. I drink, drink it also. So yeah, let me clean these sunglasses because this is hideous. Oop, not y'all at an angle. Wow. I, I can't drive the car like that, but... I sure can set it down like that. This is a towel that I keep in here to wipe the, you know, the surfaces over here. It should be good for my sunglasses, right? Yeah. I have a Cafe Oud from Kayali. I smell so freaking good right now. Insane. This is leaving a dust. Oh my God, are these tiny scratches? Hold on. What's going on? Oh, it's hairs. Why isn't it being picked up? This is annoying. These glasses are annoying. I'm annoyed. I think those are tiny scratches. These lashes are all fun and games until I'm constantly touching my sunglasses. And they're wiping my sunglasses 24-7. That's when the games are over. Hi! You look great in your, your uh, olive, what, fall tones. Thank you. Oh, you smell delightful. Yeah, that's why. I need an extra minute. What? Maybe some guys. You what? 
Mason to Wow, you smell delightful. Oh, spring. What were you spraying? Wow. It's one of those, one of the Arabia perfect does ever want you to smell. It's the orangey pinkish bottle. Orangey pink. Like those. Because you have like the pink, the white, and the orange. Yeah. Bottle. It's another one. Huh. And it's mine. It's yours. <laughs> and it smells delightful. It's mine. <laughs> yeah, because, Sorry. wow. Yeah, thank you. It's, it's, it's stunning on you. Thank you. So how does it feel to just be using all my things like this? I mean, how does it feel to just... I'm getting a different experience because I'm getting smelling it on you. It's odd. I don't I don't know if I smell like that when I put it on. Wow, that's crazy. You want to... You should just give it to me. I don't even know which one it is. There's no way. <laughs> There's no way. Listen to... Do you see what this girl is doing? Is this what you came here to do? Hi. You look stunning. Thank you. It's just the natural beauty of it all. I hate it. I love it. I, I do. I, truly I really didn't have time to like, you know... No, you don't even... It's just what? Tonight? Oh, wow. The circle and the dot. Okay. Wow. <laughs> you smell stupendous. Thank you. That's what I'm saying. Now I want to know which smell... one it is. You... I don't... Okay. You probably have a video. Let me go look. Wait. Is it a colorful bottle? Oh, maybe it is colorful. I thought it was like video. <laughs> <laughs> if you're going to say it, at least say it correctly. If it's colorful, then I know the one. Like, what? It was... Oh, it's, it's Montal. It's that... oh. Okay. It is pink and orange. I've never worn that. Really? Wow, it smells stunning on you. Oh, it smells I need amazing. to wear it tonight. You yes. know, I literally was just... Now that I see it, I remember that this is what it smells like. Yeah, I didn't even yes. smell it. I said, let's just try it. I've never worn it. Wow. That would explain why when I try to sniff it, I couldn't smell anything. Yes. I now I've, I'm reminded now that you showed it to me. Wow. Didn't you have extra amber oods? Or I'm making that up in my mind. Yes, I do. But that's why they're extra. They're backups for when I need them. What? Let's talk now. <laughs> Excuse me? Don't try to corner me later. <laughs> what? Like, which one? There are literally so many. So many. I but that one I really wanted to wear. Amber Oud, I've been missing because it's gone. Like, it's finished. It's finished. Now I'm getting the experience that I want others to get yeah. when they're around mm -hmm. me. Yeah. Because I'm... I want you to be engulfed. In yes, you have engulfed the whole car. This is how you should be... Well, if you're like me. This is how you should... <laughs> It should be when you douse yourself, no matter where you go, it should be like this. Like, I don't even stuff. smell myself. I only smell you. And the more you keep moving, I'm, I'm getting a whiff. Yeah, I like that. Wow. If anyone were to sit in this car, they'd be like, wow, what's happening in here? But you see, the same thing is true for when you smell like funk. Oh, we can smell it. <laughs> <laughs> because the whole car would be like, wow, what is happening here? And not in a good way. What is that smell? What, what is, is that the, smell? Oh, because right. this one is, what is that scent? Scent. You yeah. know what I mean? Scent and smell are different. I had a taste in that. I said, you mean scent? Because yeah. if you mean smell, I'm thinking, think oh, stinky, what is stinky? Usually. Yeah. And he's like, no, it smells good. I'm like, okay, so you mean what is that scent? Mm -hmm. And so now he knows smell and scent. Wow. This place kills me because they just, oh, look at these chairs. They just have so much stuff. You don't even know where to begin. I love these chairs. I don't need them, but I love them. Oh, these are so huge. This is really cute. See, we need some wicker baskets for the pantry. Look inside of here. These right here. Is this what we're thinking of? Oh, yeah. This is in, same idea. I like this. Oh, right here. Oh, yeah. That that looks like it's part of a set that people just took out the inside. <laughs> That's what it looks like, right? Isn't it? There's another one. Yeah, you might be right. There's another one right here. So this is what a bath sheet is. I always wondered, what? It's humongous. Okay, I want bath sheets now. <laughs> so I no longer want bath towels. <laughs> you need sheets. I need sheets. <gasps> when they, no one taught us about that. What is that? Oh my gosh. This is lovely. Hi. Eco existence. Zero twists. Zero twist loops, whatever that means. This is this is humongo. Okay, this is what I have. Hotel collection. You know what I can't stand is when all of these have lint coming out. I hate it. I used to feel like the ones that have lint are mad cheap, and that ain't even the case. It's not. <laughs> no, sorry. Oh no no. I used to feel like it was. Uh huh. Uh huh. Just shopping. Shop with, Shop with me, me basically. Yeah. Oh really? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. How's it going? It's fun. Is it? Yeah, yeah, it's fun. Yeah, we I we came to get some orga organization stuff. We're doing the pantry, mm -hmm. and then now I do need towels. Honestly, what kind of camera do you have? This is a Sony ZV-1. I have a 
was selling. Mm -hmm. Is it like the one you talk on? That mm -hmm. I forgot what one. And you can put a tripod on it and it shoots in 4K. I have one. I don't even use it because I can't see the buttons. Like I can't uh, see what it's. Oh. I was using my phone. Oh, okay. No, people use their phone all the time these days. And just because I mean that's how I met yeah. that girl. Oh yeah. She's the one who she, she walks me around. She showed me how to do it. Yeah, and yeah, she's yeah. She's up there. Okay, but. so say let's say hi to the vlog. Tell us your name. Hi, I'm Sulema with Sula Sparkos and Sakura Beauty. This is gonna go into one side. Huh. Mm, I love sea salt. Vinegar. Wow, salt and vinegar mm -hmm. popcorn. Maggot. Maggot. Wow. Okay, good. Oh, and then I get my nuts. Yes. Yeah. Has to be unsalted. Oh my god, I tried that. What roasted edamame? My mouth tasted like wood. It was so dry. <laughs> it was so terribly disgusting. And bad. I'm not like it though. I thought about going this direction, but it would take entirely too much work to now make everything gold. Honestly. Yeah, you would have to make everything gold. <laughs> I don't like no design. Imagine, yeah, because then it'd be looking like you're at. This is pretty ancient. I don't do that. This is very simple. Twenty five dollars. You feel me? I don't know. Like it'll last like ten seconds and then it's <laughs> gone. But you know, you just be getting them because. Oh. And then you be coming and getting all these random bottles for the people that you never use. I got rid of so many because they get on my nerves. I don't like bottles. And you get all kind of random plugs and stuff. Up and leave. Take a lot of courage just to live out your dreams. A picture I could see if I just close my eyes Have the foresight to believe Time don't move backwards, it speeds To the future, fit this lead Charging forward when I open my mouth Though I may not know how I know I was born to sing so cute i just did my quick and easy press-ons because i ain't got time to do that whole long process that'll be for a different day i'm blasting music so i have to go i'm gonna do my shower this is just crust from the the hairspray so ignore that i'm gonna shower neck down lotion up and get dressed so hang on i brushed my teeth i showered from the neck down and i used vaseline baby oil gel is it basil oh, baby oil gel vaseline oil gel whatever in the shower on wet <laughs> on wet skin and this is my t3 and then I damp, not damp, I towel dried my skin so that it would remain damp. That's what I mean. I'm gonna blot my skin because if you go in with a sponge with powder on it or a brush, you're putting oil onto that brush and then onto the powder. That's not what I want. All right, skin looks good. Makeup is from what, 11 a.m.? I'm gonna lighten up the middle of my lip, which you know I love. This Mario lip gloss called Soft Nude. Ooh, it's not light enough, is it? And now let's curl this wig. Hair fragrance is important. I give away my best, but get into this reset. Get into this reset. Get into this reset. Take a skill for something called the light. Get into this reset. Yeah. I'ma adjust my clock like day. Like savings next era unlocked. And I ain't playing about me. You think I'm acting brand new But this was me before you Ain't nothing
instant to start over Hold me on a new vibe Gotta recalibrate my sundial Yeah Reset Ain't nothing to start over Gotta recalibrate my sundial Yeah Recent past is feeling like a past life Can't believe I saved your heart to break mine You can see I shifted shape to fit yours Can't forget I made the move to move on PCH to the Potomac River Take a break, recalibrate, forgive her Trip the road from Stockton to Stockholm yeah, peace and grace to travel safe through time zones. Just my clock, like day, like save its next era unlocked. And I ain't playing by me. You think I'm acting brand We loved it so much that we had to do it again the next day, but this time we decided to stay in. And even though we're staying in, it was still a whole process to get ready. So I did my nighttime routine and got myself smelling real good because all of that is so important. I did my LED mask, my stressed, my body. I love these pajamas. I have it in all sorts of colors. Very free flowing. I'm wearing an XL just for room's sake. And then we just set the whole atmosphere with champagne and the fire pit. We had the fire going on the TV. That's YouTube, by the way. And then we enjoyed our night. It was so lovely. What's it called? Um, the sauna and the jacuzzi. Ja jacuzzi. Jacuzzi. Mm -hmm. So, and I'm not prepared. She ain't prepared. And I'm the one who wants to go. And the one who wants to go. You know, I got my family affairs swimsuit in the car. Family affairs. Oh yeah, I need to get some. That's not just not a phone. Send that one. Send that in October. It's freaking. <laughs> <laughs> It needs this one too. I look like a school girl. Let me, let me put it in on the inside. I can't do this right now. I'm gonna put her down because you're doing too much for me. Okay. Boom. Let my hands be free. Is it giving try and haul today? Imagine. Because the head green wig is not giving try and haul. I hate it. It's better on your waist and your butt. It'll sink you. Yes. And it looks like something that you got from Zara one time. Yeah, this is very cute. Is it? So what are you trying to say? I think it'd be cute for a try on. Oh yeah, I like this. I like this color. Mm -hmm. but Those are the kind of sweatpants you that are high waters. Did you see them? <laughs> Did you see these? Okay, I need sweatpants that are not going to be high waters on me. And she's trying to tell me that these are the kind of sweatpants that I want. These. 
Do you, have you seen them? First, this is not what we came here for. At all. I like this. I feel like I saw this and I wanted it. I it's saw probably this and I wanted $195 it. $195 at Zara. Yeah. <laughs> See, with me and my body shape, I would need to get... Okay, So then you can tuck it, yeah. Yeah. And then you can probably tuck it under. Because you have to know your body and then accentuate what's necessary. Otherwise, I'll look pregnant. So, yeah. Oh, this is cute. See, I don't need this, though. But this is really cute. These. A lot. I'm mad they don't have a size. Really? They look so dressy. Dressy sweatpants. Right? Everything's a mood, yeah. And then I need large, right? Or medium, maybe. I think you probably need a medium. Really? Medium. Sometimes their stuff do be oversized. Okay, this yeah. Is, you need a medium. You don't need a large. Okay. This looks like dressy sweatpants. Okay. All right. They're cute, though. Okay. And they have pockets. That over there was not my section. That man over there is not real. It says full coverage for confidence. You don't want to be full coverage. What you want to be? Covered is fine. Uh huh. But you want to be showing a lot of body. We work hard. Hello. Okay. And you look good. Okay. Thank you. You don't want to wear this one piece right here. <laughs> but how about this right here? Oh, they look. They got all kind of cheeky and stuff. I this, don't mind these, a one piece, but these two pieces are cool. Okay. Our smell. <laughs> showed you the updates to the pantry let me show you oh my gosh it looks so stinking good this place used to be ridiculous earlier look at how organized it is what i even need to go through here and orient myself with my own spot because i don't even know <laughs> what is going on it just looks so good it looks so much more appetizing you know how stuff just be looking so just thrown together it just looks so much better i mean that could you know it's just random storage type things but i love this a lot mm -hmm. 